Hey, here we here we are at the dog park. There's one exiting. We got Hank down there following him along. But we got plenty of dogs in the old dog cage. What do you call it? Dog park. And he's getting old Hank's getting along with these. Yes, he is. It's a great morning. 60 degrees, supposed to be up to 80, I mean, seven, high, high 70s today. And we're going to go to the Renaissance Fair. So I want you guys to hang in here. You're going to like this next video. As soon as Hank gets through visiting, it's happy hour. <laughs> Early morning in Yuma. Well, here we are at the Renaissance Fair. Two Rivers Renaissance Fair. If you've never been to one of these, they're pretty awesome. But they just set off a cannon that scared everybody within 40 miles of here. I was even shaking it. It was huge. It was right there. But we're going to go watch them joust. We're going to do a lot of things. Vicky's back there somewhere. There she is. Oh, she's still talking to the... I don't know why. But she's talking to somebody back here. And we already know where we're going. But a lot of people are dressed up in uh, their costume. We we wore our costume. <laughs> we're uh, travelers. Yeah, yeah. Uh, what are they? they uh, there they are. So we want to watch them joust, which is at 1 o'clock. And I think it's... 12.30 or so, I don't know for sure, but we're going to go check that out right now. Here's what the, the little booths selling stuff. I don't know what they're doing there. Pirates and the privateers. So, do we hazard a guess of what the difference between a pirate and a privateer is? What's your favorite? That's you. Pirates are more like freelancers, whereas privateers are contracted. That is a very good explanation. Essentially, very, very basic. We are pirates with permission. Pirates, they go off, they do whatever they wish, they don't answer to anyone. Privateers, we are commissioned by the king or queen or whoever. Since we are French, King Louis, he gives us a letter of mark. Says, go 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 harass my enemies. It's all right. It's all right. Give me about ten percent of your plunder. We'll call it good. We'll be all right. So essentially, privateer is a pirate with permission. Very smart. Ah. There is one more bonus. One more bonus. Being a privateer, being a privateer we have the we are we are agents of the king, which means pirates if they don't rob ships, they starve. They're out of shelter. We as English privateers go into any uh, excuse me French. We can go into any French port. They have to feed us. They have to restock our cabins. They have to restock our tank. So as privateers, the letter of mark means pretty much it's a unlimited visa card from the king. Say, <laughs> give us stuff. We pull into port, showing the letter of mark. We can get whatever we need. Wow. If we don't have the letter of mark, then we get nothing but the rope. <laughs> nice. Bad. Well, I guess there's a thing going on. You gotta, you have your little brochure, and if you go get stamped enough of them, that means you get a free shot glass. Uh, I'm gonna let Vicky do that, and we're going to go sit down and wait for the jousting. That's more important to us. Yes, sir. Yeah, that's right. And maybe uh, see what kind of grub they have. Breakfast burritos. Oh, you take one of them. They got food here too. Yeah, because we're going to be in there. Let's go look at that. There's a knight right there. Will you be jousting? Not today. Not today. Well, they got hamburgers, hot dogs. Look at that. Corn dog. We'll try that then. Oh, that would work. Turkey leg. We knew they'd have turkey legs. Here's the corn dog. Don't grab me a corn dog. I think that's where we got to sit. 
to watch them joust right up there. I'm gonna grab a corn dog here, guys, or something. Yeah, them corn birds. Corn dogs were good. Now we're gonna look at some other stuff because uh, the show, we still got 45 minutes. They told us the wrong time. That girl, ears stick right through her hair. <laughs> Now let's go find out what old Cassandra is up to. Yeah, she's shopping. There's some goblets. Well, I think that's all shopping over there too, isn't it? Probably. There's a cute little elf or something. Very cool. You're looking good there. Are you the queen? No, I'm the madam of the whorehouse. How are you? That's a that's queen to me. That's a queen to you. <laughs> as, as, a, as it should be, my husband. Yeah, husband. yeah. <laughs> la, 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 la. You want to see? What do you, what do you got? Oh, I'm putting up her sign, you know. You know, the queen has, you know, I got to do what the queen says. Where's the queen? She's right there. Oh. That's my queen, my black-hearted queen. <laughs> <laughs> See, she went, so we found a voodoo doll one time, and she, I said, oh, and then every time she, she and then I found a stick pin, because for some reason they're hard to find, gave it to her, and then all of a sudden when she's thinking about me, and I'll be like, oh, oh yeah, there she is. Damn. <laughs> Oh, oh, look at those hats. <laughs> oh, I got to have one of them. You're posing, I'm taking. <laughs> I got I to gotta look at those hats, guys. Hang on. Madam, do I? I do like it. Of course, it needs jewelry. Yeah. It, 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 it needs accoutrement. Oh. But I do like it, especially with the beard. Yeah, I think so. What do you think? Oh, yeah. I, I don't think your red is more your color. Red? <laughs> is there a red one? Yeah. I don't know. I didn't think you looked. Red. It's up here. There it is. There it is. You should always shop in committee. Yes. <laughs> that one looks more like you. Yeah. Well, see, she knows you better. I think the madam of the whorehouse was kind of liking me in that hat. <laughs> I would think intimately. <laughs> For 35 years. I've been wanting one of these. <laughs> I just like the spin on this one. I have to admit. That's got a nice twist to it. it that's uh, yes, I, I like the spin. I do. Does this red one up here have a spin? Wow. Pretty cool. Are you done? Yep. Mm, I don't know. One of those days. Okay, now that's a belly. Dancer. Yep. <laughs> oh, I'm feeling the ground shake. That cannon they let off a while ago, I don't know if I told you about that. Man, the whole it shook Yuma, I think. Oh, that's cool. The balance in them. That's that. Let's see what else we got. But uh, there's your chicken, uh, your turkey legs, or whatever they are. 
You, you can get those things as gnaw on them right there. Good corn dogs. There's your corn dog right there. Uh, if you've never been to one, this is what it looks like. Right here's the blacksmiths. They're doing blacksmiths. They got some goblets there to sell. Uh, I don't know what they're doing here. Let's go look and see. Yeah, yeah, they're blacksmith and they got it. There's their firing machine back there. Get it hot, beat it down. Yeah, cool. Around over here where we started a minute ago at the belly dancers. And, uh, oh, these are cool. I can afford that, maybe. Oh, a frog, hippity hoppity. <laughs> cool. But not for 10 bucks. Little thing for your aquarium. Hang on the wall, snakes. More food. All kinds of. Oh, that's for dogs. Cool. I ought to get, I ought to get my boy something. I think I will. Belly dancers are still going. They're still sitting there. I'm gonna shop for the dog. I'm gonna get a Hank that little thing. I think he'd like tearing that apart. Get him that. Looked at this other. He don't like cat figures. Yeah, but I think he'll like that. I think he wouldn't like him having a duck foot or a chicken foot. So we're gonna get Hank that right there. All right, yeah, bought something for, for the hangster. Now we're gonna walk around a little more while they're watching that. Uh, check out this and that. We got ear, uh, earrings right there. Look at the pretty ladies in there. And gentlemen. <laughs> we got more swords, lots of swords here. These are swords for kids, I think. They could have them. They could have a fun time with that. There's a Jedi. Genuine Jedi. You can see the, tell that by the way he holds it. <laughs> More stuff over there. We'll walk over that way. What do we got here? Only thing so far I would have liked to had would have been the hat, but I can't see it. Yeah, because it's going to sit there and grow dust. That's pretty neat. Set up right there. I think that's the queen. What are they doing? Watching TV? Doing something? Oh, they're talking. They're listening intently. Oh, yeah. The girl, the girl in the purple. You look, you look, you look famous. I'll tell you. <laughs> Young people and their imagination. Oh, we got lots of stuff in there. All right, back over this way. Looks like real knives over here. The real thing. I think my camera is doing weird things. I just noticed, what's it doing? Go we'll head this way, then the other. What do we got there? I don't know what. Lots of knives and swords. But if you like those, it's a place to come. <laughs> a lot of colored hair. More uh, Renaissance people coming. Pirates? Oh, no, no, no. Are you looking for the medics? Ah, there you go. <laughs> oh, we're not, we're not part of the, the quest. So, so yeah. Uh, wow. Wow. This is where they're staying, I guess, at night, because they are staying here all weekend. Umbrellas? Hats?
Battle Wolf. Gadgets and stuff. Oh, that looks like fun for the kids. What have we got here? We got, oh, Changa. With the blocks. Kanga, Kanga, whatever they call it. Each one of these will be putting on different shows. I'll try to catch them if I can. I just don't know how long we can keep the girls here. They don't seem to be that interested. And uh, we will do what we can for you guys. We had fresh fruit last month. I still got some if you're interested. <laughs> oh, here's here's your knights armor and such. Pretty cool. Somewhere here, the this is the royal court. See, there's a theory, there's a system to this thing, and I don't know what it is. What do we got here for a hat? Oh. Uh, good, hello, how much are the little hats like this? This lovely one, she's 35. Okay. I have undecorated ones for 15 as well. Let me know if you want me to bring you some colors. Oh, I kind of like that red one. I might be back for that. Oh, they can take your picture here and make you look like a knight. See, there's, a, there's what the hat looks like. Only I think it looked better on me. <laughs> oh, a magician act. You know, they you're gonna that. This one has many names in itself. In the West, they call it the Flambage. In the East, they call it the Chris. But over here in America, all of you like to call it the Wiggly One. <laughs> Which is the most appropriate name, let's be honest there, because I do feel that wiggle all the way from my tonsils down to my fallopian tubes. <laughs> Glad that so many of you have read a book. As well. <laughs> <laughs> and there's an added bonus for you. If you're watching closely, you are indeed lucky. I've been told you can actually see the sides of my throat wiggle as it goes in and as it comes out. Guess it's gross, but well, you'll watch. Holy yeah. Part of the thing goes on that sword swaller. Awesome. These guys are teaching people how to juggle. We'll pass on that because I'm helping. I'm, <laughs> that ain't happening with me. Ah, they got more hats here. Uh, I've seen one I like for $15, but not that much. Not $15 worth. Oh, look at this fine looking lady. Got some good hats. 
Well, we got to figure out our way over to get over to the jousting because that's where we're headed. The next thing that's going to be going on, I think. Bullheads. Hmm. <laughs> Telling the kids stories. Pretty awesome. Oh, that's cool. Like that. I don't know if you can hear me or not. But, uh,. We're uh, some metal words. Maybe I ought to buy a steel head a helmet. Can't imagine what they'd be. Oh. Tomorrow. Hello. The what? Tomorrow? Good morrow. Good morrow. Welcome to the barber surgeons. This is the barber surgeon. Yes, it is. Wow. There we go. And this is what tools they would use. Do you use them? I haven't personally. <laughs> I don't recommend it. <laughs> well, that looks like all the stuff they'd need, huh? Just about. Wow. And these are the herbs they would need? Yes, those would have been the medicines at the time. Where's the marijuana? <laughs> they may not have used that back then, huh? There's the knight. He's not. He said he's not going to be participating. A couple of good-looking people. Uh, what do you call them? Ah, uh, 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 Renaissance costumes. Odds and ends. She's got her furry little tails on. Well, it looks like it's filling up over that way, so we're going to head over to there. That's where we started. You've uh, pretty much seen the whole thing. Now, if I got it, if I was able to save that video, and now we're gonna go watch them joust, and then let the girls walk around and do whatever they want. Oh, they got some archery here. Yeah, let's check that one out first. We're just going on the back of that stage right there, where they're gonna be doing the jousting. Here, uh, I, I hear Robin Hood's here somewhere. Well, I might try that. It's a dollar an arrow. I'll give her a dollar. See what I can do. Uh, I got to get Vicky though to film me, just in case I shoot my foot. But we're back to the corn dog thing. That's a circle, a wrap, or whatever you want to call it. For that. Now let's go watch them joust. Well, guys, this video is exactly double what I usually put on here. But I wanted to just put it all on here. You can just kick back, drink your coffee and watch this renaissance fair it was pretty awesome i tried to show you everything there uh there's going to be a part two on just the jousting alone this is a picture of them getting ready to do so it's going to be quite a long little video too but i'm going to leave it on there in its raw uh stage so you can see that it'll be part two of this so I'll just wait for uh 48 hours and there'll be the jousting at the renaissance fair coming up next